you will learn about linear equations in one variable. Here are some examples of equations. Look at these equations. These equations state the equality of arithmetic expressions. Arithmetic expressions are mathematical expressions that are made up of numbers. Equations are also used to state the equality of algebraic expressions. Algebraic expressions are made up of variables and numbers. Based on these examples, an equation can be defined as a mathematical statement in which symbols are used to express equality between mathematical expressions. Let's reconsider some of the equations we saw earlier. As you can see, these equations have algebraic expressions on the left of the equality sign and numbers on the right. Such equations are called algebraic equations. Now, let's focus on the left-hand side of the equations. Can you see any difference between these expressions? The first expression has a variable with degree 1. The second expression has a variable with degree 2. While the last expression has two variables, where both variables have degree 1. Algebraic expressions with degree 1 are called linear expressions. All expressions that have degree greater than 1 are not linear. Now, let's consider the first equation. It is linear expression with one variable. Such an equation is called a linear equation in one variable. The expression on the left of the equality sign is the LHS of the equation, while that on the right is its RHS. Let's analyze this equation further using a balance scale. We will place the LHS of the equation on the left pan of the balance and the RHS on the right pan. As you can see, both sides are equal. The values of both the LHS and the RHS are equal. On the right pan, we have a number that is a constant. However, on the left pan, the expression has the variable A. Now, if we replace A with a number, say 3, the LHS is no longer equal to the RHS. Let's put another number 5. No, it's still not equal. Let's put another number, 9. Yes, now it's a perfect balance. This means that the LHS and the RHS of the equation will be equal only for a specific value of the variable. This value is called the solution of the equation. In this case, the solution is 9. Now, if we add a value on the RHS, we will have to add the same value to the LHS to make both sides equal.